Now, in home design, we are joined by Hamish, who's here to show us some great things, some ideas to do with the kids during the school holidays. Hey, Hamish. Hello, team. How are we? Good. We're well. Good, good, good. Okay, so uh, we all know that uh, the exciting time for children and the dread for parents is about to be upon us. We have school holiday time. Yes, we do. Awesome. I mean, yay, quality time Ooh. with my child. That's right. <laughs> okay, so uh, what we thought we'd do is, you know, it's a couple of weeks away, uh, well, a week away or so, isn't it, really? Soon. I yeah. forget, but hey, it'll, I'll find out, won't I? <laughs> <laughs> when your kid's not at school. We're the only yeah. one sitting there. <laughs> so I thought what we'd do is we'd, um, we'd come up with some, some sort of crafty ideas, something to help fill in time, um, and rather than having, you know, mm-hmm. You're doing kind a of craft thing. corner, a craft, craft corner. Craft corner. Yes, yes, never thought I would. No, I was just going to say that. Here, here I am. Hello, craftiness. Excellent. Thank, thankfully, we have Jasmine, sweet producer, who's very crafty. Oh, yeah, she does a bit okay. of craft as that, Jazz. So, so what okay, are we going to do first? First thing we're going to talk about is painting a lampshade, okay? okay. And now, you, you, that <laughs> young Mike, I have a fine example here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bring it up now and tell you. So, you're so naughty. Here it is. Painting a lampshade's a great idea. Right, look. Yes, no, it is. It's a great idea. I've done this before. I've actually done look this craft at this. before. And you'll notice this says... Because it's bright. Chloe and Jazz, yes, the, the wattage of the bulbs clearly a little excessive, but we'll work, we'll, work, <laughs> we'll work on that in the future. Okay, well, take back my laugh. That's kind of cute. Right, so our, our dear friend, um, Chloe, uh, she painted this for us. There's a picture of Chloe with the lamp after she's finished it. Oh, happy. Awesome. I know, she's our little friend of the show. So now I'm going to cover off what she used. I was going to say we used, but clearly I didn't get involved because <laughs> it all worked out. Mm. So there's a few paint types in here. We've used the prime colours, yes. okay, which you can pick up from Resine and Test Pots. You're looking at $4.50 for each Just one of those. Turn it up We're before gonna it turn blinds it off me. Before we there get we go. Yeah. The side of the paint. <laughs> I get you can use fluoro colours. Now I have to read this because, by goodness, you think I've can be $8.90. Okay, oh, yeah, cool. for an 80 mil. Yeah. So it's, it's, it's relatively well priced because I mean, you can use these you know, for multiple children if yeah. you have them. This is glow in the dark paint, okay? Also very cool. Uh, to get the best effect of it, it's got to go onto white and you probably want to like do three sort of thick layers. Yeah. Okay. okay. And then, oh my goodness, these are really exciting. Uh, these are your metallics. Oh, glow in the dark paint, you're looking at about $13.80. These are $5.50. You're going to spend a little bit more for the test pot of this, but I'm going to crack it open. Are you ready? Yep. Yeah. This is called um, Sugar and Spice. <gasps> oh, look at that. Yeah. That looks like, like a video, Mike. Yeah. Yeah. It's quite nice, I'll isn't it? I'll splash that on the And you can get these little things anywhere quite cheaply, can't you? Well, you can. You can yeah. get that, for, that one there's from, I believe, Bunnings, and uh, it was a whopping price of $12 whole oh, oh, dollars. Yes. Okay. So this, okay. Is so this is not an expensive mm. thing to do, okay? Another great thing is, as you'll see on the uh, screen right now, you'll see a picture of of uh, egg carton. That's what you use to put the children's paint in. Don't let them have at it with all this stuff because they're just going to create no, a mess. No, they'll make a mess. You want to keep way. these for the next time you paint well, something. You do, because they're going to last a long time if you store them properly. And speaking of painting other things, oh dear, yes, what is, go. I think, 1985 called and wants its craft <laughs> back. What are you saying is back in fashion? <laughs> painting rocks. <laughs> Shush, quiet. Really? Yes, it's, it's back in fashion. You're going to find it all over New Zealand. Um, people are painting rocks again. I can hear young Mike okay, painting rocks are fashionable again. Now what's happening is people are leaving these round trails. My goodness, I hope really? the suit comes up well. I'm hearing young Mark over there chuckling away. Okay, so, so yeah, keep going. <laughs> right, okay. So painting paint rocks and making soup. Okay, but anyway. It's so they're leaving them round trails. They're so naughty. Yes, people are leaving round trails. Okay, on, on Waiheke there's a little trail. People are painting rocks, leaving them around. There's something fun for oh, you. Well, that's you can cool. paint a town with your children. Rocks are free. Go get some. Actually, paint them with your children. That's kind Make of cool. a little town for your cars to go around. Oh, and look, what's And you that? can play dominoes, dominoes. if you, you know go. how to play dominoes. I must admit that's pretty cool, but I don't know if I could get all my boys sitting down painting rocks. I've got like one that, one that's a teenager. What are you going to do with them? Do I have an answer for this? It was pre-written for me. Yeah. <coughs> Rock painting is for everyone. <laughs> a great thing to do, which actually isn't as daunting as one might think. Makeover time. <laughs> Oh, there are instructions for jazz hands in there. Oh, I don't know, but then it says talk us through this. <laughs> and I think it's pretty self-explanatory. Yeah, get oh, no, no, look, there's the glow-in-the-dark ones next to a path. Yes. Oh, well, there you go. You see, you could... That's a lot of work, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, I take it back. That's actually quite no, cool. It's a bit of fun. Sure. Okay, so some fun things to do with kids, and kids like painting rocks. Nice work. We, nice and cheap. Keeps we, them occupied. We love having you come in, Hamish. I know, and the good thing is you can pop down to your resine store like I did, just go and see your little old mates there, and, you know, they they have crafty stuff as well. Nice. Who knew? Good. Okay, thank Get you so much, look. Hamish. Get the look at resine.co.nz. Nice work. Yep, thanks, Hamish. Thanks. And you, you bring some rocks next time. We'll do some craft corner painting.